the Vile Five. And this is John Kai, Johnny Slat, and I'm Ollie Wisden. Hey, back to business. Have you got that plan, Johnny? I certainly have, Ollie. Today, we're going to take you on a little tour of a little bit of our lives and take you to one vile tea party, yeah. show you how we put on makeup, like and parties. generally show you, I don't know, various aspects of being a specimen. As you can see, it's a bit like being a faggot, but it's not really. Well, not at all. I mean, Johnny Carson wears makeup. I mean, if it's good enough for him, um, you know, it should be good enough for your average redneck tracker, really, shouldn't it? We actually might give away free lipstick with our next record. We don't know. We're considering the possibility of men wearing, I don't know, lipstick for men. I think you should have fun dressing up. Now, I think in the same way that we all have to eat food, but we don't eat the bare essentials to stay alive. We try and um, make our lives a little bit more pleasurable by choosing food um, that we enjoy to eat. But I, I, I think there's a, a distinct comparison between that and, and my personal views, at least for dressing up. Before we start eating, man, we all say grace. So, which is only proper. May the, may the fiend please make us truly grateful for what we are about to receive and please bring we us a bucket because we're going to throw up. And on that cue, we will start. Oh, I can't eat eggs like that for more. Where's the blub? Mm. Looks like that's all I'll need. Mm. 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 They're great. Anybody like some drink? Where's the beef? Yeah. And the way you look definitely yeah, affects the way you act. And we're not doing it so much for other people, we're doing it to affect ourselves. It's, it's just like when the Indians put on war paint, they were psych psyched up to fight. Uh, and it's, it's a very, very similar sort of thinking behind that, if you like. I mean, if, if you feel like the average person in the street in a pair of jeans and sneakers or whatever, you're not going to be inspired to sort of, I don't know, think differently, do differently. We'd like you to have some. Pass us the dip, please. Tea for anybody? Okay, would you like some? <laughs> people always talk about our influences as being Bowie and T-Rex and being the whole sort of glam thing. But this man's my biggest influence, I'm probably his. Um, and we've, we very, very much feed off each other. And, you know, the same with Johnny and Kevin and Chris. I mean, like, I don't know, so, like, we wind each other up all the time and it's really good fun. Yes. 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 Let's feed the pigs. Feed him. Yes. Pigs. Pigs like lots of food. Yes. At the moment, my life is 100% day in, day out, part of the band, and it is the most exciting thing that I've ever done in my life. I, you know, this is the best bunch of people I know. It's the best fun that I've ever had. I'm doing exactly what I want to do creatively. So, I mean, you know, I'm, I, it's very difficult to see beyond that or to see an end to that. Who wants some too? Oh. I feel like I'm about nine, uh, nine years old today because I've got sort of shorts on. Yeah, it makes me feel different. Makes me feel like quite a brat, actually. Makes me feel, feel like some you know, things like. Uh, I want my, you know, limo now, or else.
Why not join us yourselves? And back to you, Peter.